for this problem, I'll start by identifying my m and n terms. An exact differential equation is in the form m dx plus n dy is equal to 0. The coefficient for dx is going to be m, which in this case is 2xy squared minus 3. And the coefficient for dy is n, which in this case is 2x squared y plus 4. We can now take the partial derivative of m with respect to y. That's going to be 4xy. We can take the partial derivative of n with respect to x, which is also going to be 4xy. Because these terms are the same, we know that this differential equation is exact. We can now take the integral of m with respect to x, which is going to be the integral of 2xy squared minus 3 dx. This will evaluate 2x squared y squared minus 3x plus g of y. This is our function. To find g of y, we can take the partial derivative of f with respect to y. This is definitionally equal to n. So we can now find the partial derivative of x squared y squared minus 3x plus g of y with respect to y. This is going to be 2x squared y plus g prime of y. This is going to be equal to n. We said that n is equal to 2x squared y plus 4. I'll write that here. And this is going to be equal to the term we just found. These 2x squared y's will cancel. And we'll find that g prime of y is equal to 4. We can now take the integral of both of these sides with respect to y, and we'll find that g of y is equal to 4y. We can now plug this into the function up here. We'll get that the function is equal to x squared y squared minus 3x plus 4y. So I can write this, x squared y squared minus 3x plus 4y is equal to c. And that is our final answer. If this video helped you, consider subscribing.